Hi, this video is about biometrics appointments for asylum seekers, also known as fingerprint appointments. Biometrics are a normal part of the asylum process. And the most important thing to know about biometrics is that it is very important to go to your biometrics appointment. If you do not go, your asylum application and your work permit application could be denied. In this video, I will explain one, what a biometrics appointment is, two, how to schedule your biometrics appointment, three, what happens at a biometrics appointment, four, how to reschedule your appointment if you cannot attend, and five, what to do if you miss your appointment. What is a biometrics appointment? A biometrics appointment is an appointment with the United States Citizenship and Immigration Services, or USCIS. During your biometrics appointment, USCIS will collect your fingerprints, photo, and signature. A biometrics appointment is also sometimes called a fingerprint appointment. If you apply for asylum, you will be required to go to a biometrics appointment. It is a normal part of the asylum process. The information that USCIS gathers from you during your biometrics appointment will be used to confirm your identity and also to check your immigration history and any criminal history. It is extremely rare to be detained at a biometrics appointment, even if you have a deportation order or criminal history. So please don't be afraid to go to your biometrics appointment. If you do not go to your biometrics appointment, your asylum application could be denied. It could also result in delays in getting your work permit or even a denial of your work permit. So it is very important to go to your biometrics appointment on the scheduled date. Where do I go for my biometrics appointment and what happens there? Your biometrics appointment notice tells you the date time, and location of your appointment. When you go to your appointment, you need to bring your appointment notice with you. You also need an identification document, such as your passport. A valid government-issued identification document is best, but if you do not have one, you can try bringing your birth certificate, your school ID, any expired IDs, a copy or photo of an ID, or an immigration document with your photo on it, like this ICE check-in log. You should plan to arrive 15 minutes before your appointment time at the USCIS office listed on your appointment notice. When you arrive at the USCIS office, you will first go through a security line. Then, you will check in with a receptionist and wait for your turn. The process is usually quick, but sometimes you may have to wait a while. At the end of your appointment, USCIS will put a stamp on your notice showing that you went to your appointment. Here's what that stamp looks like. Make sure you keep this notice somewhere safe and bring it with you to your immigration court hearing or your asylum interview with USCIS. What should I do if I cannot go to my biometrics appointment? If you cannot go to your biometrics appointment, you can call the USCIS contact center at one 800 375-5283 before your appointment date and let them know why you need to reschedule your appointment. If you miss your appointment, your asylum application could be denied. Because of this, it is very important that you reschedule your biometrics appointment before your scheduled appointment date. What should I do if I already missed my biometrics appointment? 
Missing a biometrics appointment can cause your asylum case to be denied or delayed. It could also cause your work permit application to be denied or delayed. That is why it is important to try to reschedule your biometrics appointment as soon as possible if you already missed it. If you already missed your appointment but it has been less than a few weeks, you can try going to the USCIS office location listed in your biometrics appointment notice. You can explain your situation to the officers and ask them to take your fingerprints at that time. Some USCIS offices allow this. If you already missed your appointment and it has been more than a few weeks, you can call the USCIS contact center at 1-800-375-5283 as soon as possible. You can explain your situation to them and ask them to reschedule your appointment. If you are having problems with your immigration case because you missed your biometrics appointment, you may wish to find legal assistance to understand your options. Below this video, we have included a link to an ASAP webpage about how to find legal assistance. Thank you so much for watching this video. For more resources, please check out the links below this video, watch other videos in this channel, or go to our website at asylumadvocacy.org. Thank you.